For the hip hinge exercise, we're just trying to learn how to move the hips properly um, for a, uh, a deadlift or some variation of that. You're usually going to need a wall or something you can bump into. In this case, I have the rack, um, but a wall is going to be a little bit easier or door. Um, so place yourself in front of whatever you have available. Um, usually six to eight inches to start is a good place. Um, and then from here, we're going to have the feet at least a shoulder width wide. So mine's actually a little bit wider than that. Shoulder width wide, softening in the knees. And from here, your goal is to feel almost as if you had a rope around the hips and someone is pulling your hips back. So I'm not trying to bend forward. I'm trying to keep my body upright. My back is super strong. And from here, I'm just folding at the hips, pressing them back and forward. The wall is for, as a cue for you to be able to feel where your butt is going. If it feels like you're too restricted, like you don't have enough space, move further away from the wall, press your hips back and touch and move back forward. And hands can be here or they can be behind the head. Do your best, the best you can on this movement. It is kind of a complicated movement at first, but film yourself off on one side if you are filming. Um, and you can record how many you're able to do. Um, just send in the video and we'll make some adjustments to your form.